that's the cool thing is that at a certain point when you start getting all these different stuffs that you can actually you know pick whatever one part you want you can just make whatever Gundam that you want and use those plastics and stuff that you get from doing quests like these to get it up to the max level I remember in Gundam Breaker 3 I was like I wonder how far I can go using just a Zaku Got pretty far. Pretty far. It was a bit of a struggle, and I did not do as good as I thought I would, but the beginning portion's very easy. The later portion's a little, little more on the difficult side. <laughs> Just try to keep up with me, okay? But it can also be like a skill thing. Just gotta defeat the target mobile suit. Gotta try to charge me. That moves over here. Oh, he uses both of them. Darn. Oh no, I just don't have enough EX. Never mind. Fresh from the boxes. Do you think we can take it? This will show them. Double head. S rank and doing do the next one. great. Watch my back. Let's go. I won't stay down. Should actually be gone after these guys to get some more parts. defense on that one. And another. Took out the boss too soon. Fresh from their boxes. Can we really beat that thing?
Oh, I'm getting like dragged around. Give me your parts. Your precious parts. off the iron blood orphans good series like I usually like the universal century stuff but as for an, an off universal century it's a good series It's actually getting broken. with a melee slash claw type weapon we did it a perfect score are you some sort of new type say that every time and i keep telling you yeah yeah i am i'm i'm gundam jesus Ooh, four star extra large sword Rank 10, save limit for gallery is increased. Then we got some preset colors. I think another thing I gotta spend uh, off camera doing is designing a diorama. Or maybe do like a uh, speed run, or not a speed run, but a, a speed sped up video of the process. Look, our next weapon that we're gonna be using. Oh wait, there's a katana. We haven't used a uh, katana type. I think I have to use this first. Rifle high speed. I mean, the only reason we were using these certain weapons was just because of the achievement. Anything four star. Here we are. A left arm for uh, Daryl Blade, which gives us Beam Saber and uh, Azara A-Type. Oh, it gives us a lot of things, actually. Amabika, all range attack. Did we happen to pick up a right arm of them? Nope, just a left arm. That's a bummer. If it gave us all of that in just the one arm, that'd be great. But a lot of the ones that I've seen with specials, it's like it requires us to have both. But we did get... Uh, Darrell Blade Backpack, which gives us Beam Saber, Esavara B-Type, and all range attack on EX. Alright, we're good to go. Oh yeah, and equip. And equip. Uh, but we are changing this to the extra large mace. Separate forearm and attacks, locked on targets from all directions. Fires two hand funnels from the backpack and attacks locked on targets from all directions. Launches the shoulder shield to orbit around the mobile suit, reducing beam and physical damage and damaging any enemies who come near. That I like. Now we can only choose one of the other ones here. Attacks locked on targets. Do the two. One from the backpack. OP skills. Not missing anything, but I could bring something else up. Let's do the GN beam saber throw that comes with our legs. All right, we're good. 
Let's do a new paint scheme, shall we? With the Dom Tropin. We have not done that. Let's do that. Dom Tropin. We're ready now to continue doing quests for Chapter 2. Right, Who's our boss on this red planet? Is it the Apple Seed again? No, it's Unicorn Gundam yet again. Way there. Down to our level. Welcome. Ooh, I like that uh, melee weapon we got. Coming down. You're coming down. Yeah, he's coming down. Boom, boom, boom. Get out of here. Okay, next one. Blew its arm off. That was great. Oh, who's the next one? Oh, this thing. Your face looks like a crutch. And it's already down. Should've with one of these, and another one of these. And another one of these. Is dead. <laughs> oh, it's all that that mace weapon of just like rapid strikes to it. That was so quick. A perfect score. Are you some sort of new type? Ooh, new body, the four star. The Phoenix Unicorn Gundam 03 body. Gives us NTD. Yes, yeah, the only thing we got is some plastics. Next. Let's do this.
Oh, here comes another one. Ooh, four star head. Four star rifle. Let's do the next one. It's like we're going to be losing the bazooka. Oh, is that a mobile worker? Nice. I like that they got all these different shaped mobile suits now. Like I remember seeing the video and they had uh, a horse and I think it was like Master Gundam's horse that he rides in on. They got gun tank over here and a gun tank Zaku tank. We saw ball, so they got ball in here. Gotta go and harvest the credits off of this thing. Strong enemy incoming. Watch out. There we go. Thousand GP. Ooh, yeah. Okay, next one. Oh, it was wave two. I thought that was wave one. They want to take on the champs. Stab him rapidly. Boom! With an epic finish. There you go, chapter two quests done. Zipped right on through. And there you have it, another quest chapter down. We got upgrades to our Gundam. And I believe I mentioned in the last video that that was going to be the last update to the Gundam. I'm, I'm late on that. This is about the last one. We're still looking to replace certain parts with four stars. 
and you're gonna see more of that probably in the next video but we are we're getting to where you're gonna see one Gundam for quite a bit of videos until five stars come around so uh, stay tuned for that anyways thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next game of Gundam Breaker 4 goodbye